Hey, welcome back to No Hype Beer Reviews, unless you're watching it on one of the other two channels. Uh, in which case, go to the other ones and just subscribe to all of the channels. Um, and um, I'm going to actually not do my normal review intro because it's already been thrown off by me. I got Mike from NerdSense, <laughs> but if you're watching on NerdSense channel, you know that already. Joe from The Beer Patrol, if you're watching that channel, you already know it already. And Sean, also from NerdSense, and I'm Kyle from No Hype Beer Reviews. And this is all of us. And Clayton, <laughs> sorry, brother. Um, it was... It was really tough to get everyone's schedule to sync up to do this, but we are doing it now, which I think it might be more fun, yes. how old this beer is. Uh, so he was nice enough to send each channel a can of a mystery beer, yeah. hoping we would all do it together much quicker than we did. I will take the blame because I, I did get, I did get a stomach flu, but since then, <laughs> we could not link up at all. It was yeah. like, this guy's out of town, this guy can't do it, yeah. my schedule's out, so... It's life. It, it happens. And now it we're happens. in person doing it, which is also yeah. cool. Yeah, real cool. You know, so yeah, let's get into it. on the beer. <laughs> well, yeah, so I'll open. Mike and I will do this one. You guys open. Do that one. What the fucking thing is. And we're going to, and we have one can left that we didn't use for this review, so we're oh. going to give it to someone else inside. Yeah, we might see if uh, I'm just going to pour out. I'll do mine first. It doesn't happen when I open cans, Joe. Well, get beep, nerd. What do you want to do? <laughs> oh, you can swear on my channel. Just yeah, but it's not a Kyle. You know, it's just... I just knew you didn't want to open it. I need a little bit more. Yeah. I'm just trying not to say... I, I, I tried to do a mic pour. Bleed out on camera. Pour? Clayton would probably like Can we that. appreciate that I poured Mike a mic pour? Yeah. I, he didn't even pour that. I did that. I can appreciate that. All yeah. right. So this... Well, I have a first thought about what it might be. Yep. Me too. All right. So it looks West Coasty. Yes. Yep. Mm -hmm. Right? Okay. Okay. I, dude, the nitro, the, the head looks like a nitro head. It does, actually. Whoa, yeah, super tiny compact bubbles. Wow. Like, insane looking. And it's almost like eggshell colored. Yeah. 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 Ooh, I'm stealing that in future. Because I'm always like, it's off-white, but I don't know how else to say it. Eggshell white. Yeah, eggshell white. There you go. Dude, I love it. look at the, like, it, it's... Is this a, a barley wine? Oh, Ooh, interesting. Because the color kind of looks... Like the, the, like the copper color kind of English barley wine style, yeah. right? Yeah. Well, that's why I was thinking American. But let's see. I like this trend. Yeah. And there, there are some legs. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. There's definitely colors. So yeah. this is yeah. not a pale ale, I don't think, based on the legs. Should we get into that aroma? I think we should. We should. Let's All right, do it. gentlemen. Yep. Yep. That's either a barley wine or a really old IPA. <laughs> <laughs> it's one of the two, but they can be the same. They can, yeah, I think like I don't think this is obviously 120 minute, but I think of that like is that an IPA or is that a barley wine? This is this, what, is, this is skirting wine? the American yeah. barley line imperial IPA slam. line. Yeah, it's yeah, it could be. What? Wow. Or is it hop slam? Ooh, oh, which would fit with yeah. it's got a what sweet we're tone discussing, too, right? Yeah, yeah. It wouldn't be an English barley wine, but yeah, I'm getting like a pronounced like orange in there. Yeah. Well, and that's why I'm thinking it is. American yeah, yeah. again, either ten percent IPA, West Coasty kind of IPA, that or American. And this yeah. is the fun about doing these reviews with more people because a lot of times you wouldn't say stuff like once he said hop slam in yeah. my mind I'm thinking honey now. Yeah, and yeah, I'm yeah. like oh yeah that's yeah. this could be honey yeah. sweetness man there is totally fine now but. Uh, any other thoughts on the aroma before we get into the taste? It's it's it definitely to me it smells more like an American barley wine that has some age on it as. Okay. More than an imperial IPA that has some age on it. Yeah. Okay. Like kiss of oxidation. Yeah. yeah, I think it's fair. Anything, Mike? Before we go. No. It smells pretty, pretty, pretty sweet, though. Yeah. All right. I think we're on the pretty same sweet. page. Pretty good. Right. Cheers. Cheers. Clink, clink, clink with these plastic clink, glasses. Clink, clink. Thanks, Clayton. Clink. Fake clinks. Also, if anyone's wondering, yeah, I am clink. sitting in a lower chair than everyone else. That's why I'm not towering over them. So that's what everyone's wondering right now. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh wow. They're not watching for if we figure it out or not. They're watching to figure out height order. Yeah. Is this nitro? I don't think so. I don't think it, it's it creamy is, enough. It is think it real. Is? No, carbonation wise, there's not. It's very dank hoppy resin. Dude, I will say this: it's super subdued to the nose. Like I'm not yeah. getting as much. Like the nose was like really intense. The nose was like boisterous. The taste, it's. It, I enjoy it to some degree, but I just it's not like the nose was. It didn't carry over to a tea like I thought it would. I mean, I'm. I, maybe I'm stuck because of what I first thought when I looked at it. I mean, I, I am getting West Coast. Yeah, yeah. That kind of hops, right? that kind of yep. how the malt is hitting, almost a little like yeah, hop no. syrupy, which I think is uh, almost like the it, there. It, there's some viscosity to it, but yeah, almost like this caramel. But like as you're yeah. making the caramel, you're hopping it. If yeah. that makes sense, like it's got that. So unlike the nose, I feel like the taste is screaming imperial IPA of some sort. Yeah. Because I feel like if it was an aged barley wine, the hop, the uh, malt complexity. 
and everything would be a little bit more like in your face and I don't think I, I think it's more subdued which would make me lean towards more of a faded I, imperial IPA. yeah like old school IPA like we say West Coast this would be like the most hopped American barley wine I've ever had yeah yeah um, there is a little thinness at the end yeah. which also makes me think it's not in that barley wine right category at all and it's definitely not hop slam because you're not getting any of that like honey sweetness I don't think I wouldn't mm, say it's definitely not though <laughs> Uh, yeah, I'm, yeah, I am getting sweetness. I'm not quite sure it's honey, but it's a little marmalade. Yeah, 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 I love yeah, yeah. So yeah, yeah, I love them. And, and here's the thing, for me, and I, I've always said this in older IPA reviews, I always get orange marmalade on like white bread. And yeah, I'm getting that to some degree yeah. here, which would indicate to me again, Imperial IPA that has faded. That was relatively fresh when Clayton sent it to oh, us. Oh yeah, yeah. No, it's now is, faded into this is this. on us. But this isn't bad. It's no, not, that's not. It, it's all right. No, whatever this is, again. I think we all agree this has. We know it has age on it. Yeah. The problem we've had them in our possession. Are we all around the ten percent? Yeah. Between yeah. Eight and ten, I think. Eight and ten. Between eight and ten. Eight I'm and thinking. ten. Yeah, I'm gonna say ten. But I'm prob- gonna say straight ten, yeah. And it, so probably caps at ten. We would be surprised if this was a lot. Oh yeah, because right? the, okay. the, the booziness doesn't indicate yep. like huge. Like, man, you're you're, it's it's aged, so I don't know. Ten might be a little bit high, but I'm gonna still lock it. Think, I'm I'm thinking it's in the realm of of like a like a pl- plenty or a, a heady. Gotcha. You know? mm-hmm. okay. that's, those were about eight percent. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. That's my opinion. No, no, I like the, I like the eight to ten range. Could this be? But, does Revolution make like a big Imperial IPA? Like. Uh, is there one in like their is it hero series? Yeah, right? yeah. I'm Could thinking if maybe hero this hero? is kind of like so this something is in that where series. he is geographically. Well, I'm just thinking about 12 ounce cans that he can probably yeah. get in the general but, vicinity. Not even not even like closed breweries, but just something he could get. But in aren't like, the hero series aren't those more uh, stable? They wouldn't like age like oh, yeah. poorly. I, yeah, then you you would maybe think I don't know. I never aged one. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> maybe we did for the. I don't know. I, I'm gonna say 10 percent Imperial IPA. It almost feels nitro. It's not going to be nitro, but no. it almost feels. It's just it's really soft, that thinness, more so than I thought. That and, thinness and at thin. the end, um, and Mike's got it in my head too, like the eight percent. I'm going to stick with what I think, ten percent. But I'll just say I wouldn't be surprised if Mike is is onto something with the eight percent. All right, so you're saying? Oh, I'm, oh, I'm sorry. sorry. I was going to say, are we ready to open? So well, I was yeah. going to say, let's lock it in. Your ten percent imperial yep. IPA. Yep. I'm going to go nine five. I'm going to change it just to be different. Nine I'm going to go ten one. I, I, ten one nine I, five. I, I'm going to say ten. But I'm not. I won't be surprised if Imperial it's IPA. To, yep. Yep. And yeah, I'm thinking eight, eight and a half. Um, Imperial IPA. Okay. Um, yeah, it's it's good. I sort of like I, I do. Get, I enjoy like, this experience. I got yeah. a nice amount of pine, a little bit of yeah. dankness, a little bit of apricot, a little marmalade. Yeah. Yes. A little yeah. caramel. I think it's that good. marmalade that was probably one of the better tasting. Those, yeah. Probably because yeah. I think you nailed it. Now here's the thing too, Clayton. Even though he might be disappointed if this was something that was supposed to be super fresh, the beauty mystery beers, we're supposed to be trying to figure out what we're tasting right now. And it's a six-month-old yeah, beer at the very, very least, so. All right. Red can. Ooh, don't really recognize I think it's that. A, oh, we are Big not going to be happy about this. Because we're zombie dust? I was going to say zombie dust. Zombie, zombie dust? Pan. There's no fucking way this is zombie dust. It is. 6.5% so four ABV. people just completely So I was going to say that I was going to say when you said 12 ounces uh, somebody said something originally and I was to be like watch if he zombie does it poured out like it dude dude there there this drinks way bigger it canned on good. January 31st Yes it drinks way bigger <laughs> Yeah like 9 months on Yeah 9 months Well um That is wild Yeah wow As the uh wow. Quote of the day goes, get bleeped, nerds, because we just did. <laughs> yeah, we uh, 6.5. Whiffed. This intensely hopped and gushing zombie undead dust. pale ale zombie will be dust. one's only respite after the zombie apocalypse. Oh, sorry, is this for like a thumbnail <laughs> no, or I, something? No, I, I'm just showing because the, um, the label's awesome. The label's great. I love the can art. It, it doesn't show the whole original drawing. Which had all like the cool like yeah. comic book yeah. Easter eggs, and it had like that glow. They had like 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 uh. The, yeah, the, like the, 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 the actually it was like the, the sparkly, sparkly yeah the yeah, shiny yeah yeah, yeah. Cool. yeah if people don't know it's cool like it's got like a spider-man kind of spider on his chest he's holding like a hammer like molnir um this is certainly anyway weak. dude there is no way i would ever tell you this is under eight percent drinking it yeah. right now mike was the closest though he was he said he yeah. was not <laughs> like significantly closer <laughs> well <laughs> winner winner chicken dinner <laughs> yeah yeah so that is a trip i'm not saying not to age zombie dust We'll probably don't. <laughs> yeah, probably but but don't. no, but we like the taste. Oh, yeah, but it just that's it almost turned from what you expect from zombie dust, imperialized it, subdued it a bit, 
the def- I don't remember the body and mouthfeel being like this creamy yeah. and soft. Like this yeah. is like I don't say New England style, but like this is not zombie dust. But style. It, <laughs> you know, again, I mean? like, that, that, that thinness at the end, it, it yeah. So maybe yeah, maybe that it, it's definitely thin. Um, I, st- I still fucking can't believe this is yeah. It's six and a half. We right? have to six take that half. third can and see what other people say. Yeah, we need like, to hide. We have, have to. to hide these so cans. be on the look for that. Yeah, yeah, we'll throw them. Out. Oh, we'll just, throw them away. Just out surprise here. mystery viewers. Like, oh, you think that is, guys? Um, all right. So again, like, depending on which channel you're watching this on, make sure you subscribe to everyone else. We got Nerd Sense, we got the Beer Patrol, we got No Hype Beer Reviews, and uh, Clayton. Then thanks again, man. So, uh, obviously, we do really appreciate it. And one more time, uh, sorry it took us so long, but we did it, and it was super fun. And I don't know, it makes me happy because we're all together. It yeah, does. that's the best part. Clayton, I'd apologize, but like you gave a zombie dust. We try to get super old. We look like idiots. Like, I'm not happy. <laughs> yeah, true. We're not happy. Yeah, to be fair, we paid our patents because we look yeah. like idiots on the internet. Yeah, yeah. So there you go. Yeah, none of us have, uh, how do you say, a good palate. And that's just <laughs> how it is. Cheers, everybody. Cheers. <laughs> Cheers.